I'm uh, Tony LaFound, I'm the Penfield Town Supervisor, and uh, welcome. Uh, this, is, uh, this is something that uh, you know, we have talked about uh, for a number of uh, months, maybe even uh, close to a year, uh, about doing something uh, like this. Uh, Dick Vendel, I had the honor of knowing for a number of years, and uh, to have known him uh, in a number of different uh, capacities. Uh, and uh, uh, as a town board member, uh, as a supervisor, uh, I also had an opportunity to work very closely with him on uh, some remodeling projects that, uh, that he helped me out with and uh, really uh, got to know Dick uh, as uh, truly a very special, special person. And uh, unfortunately, uh, it seems like uh, the good people uh, are the ones that, uh, that go uh, all too early. Uh, but uh, we're, we were honored on behalf of the town of Penfield uh, to have him part of our team uh, and as I said to Nancy earlier, uh, we had the gift of Dick being here, uh, teaching a number of our people, working with a number of our people, uh, and uh, was a, a great uh, coach, mentor, uh, and uh, support uh, for a lot of people here. Uh, there, there's a number of folks that uh, I'd like to recognize, but I, I'd like to just uh, take a minute and uh, talk a little bit about uh, what we have here behind us. Um, when uh, we, we did some work here at uh, DPW, uh, we had a need to make sure uh, that uh, we were taking care of the water that was coming off the site. So as you can imagine, uh, DPW facility is one of those necessary evils. We need it for plowing roads, patching roads, uh, doing everything uh, to keep the infrastructure in our communities uh, going, growing, and uh, safe. And uh, one of the things that happens is that uh, you have a lot of stuff that comes off site, uh, maybe some residue from salt, uh, diesel fuel, antifreeze, uh, things like that. And uh, we wanted to make sure we were doing and responsible uh, citizens uh, for cleansing that water before it went into our waterways. So uh, we designed this uh, rain garden behind us. Uh, Mark Valentine, who's our town engineer, put it uh, together. Bruce Sareski from uh, Sareski Associates was the person that identified all the plants and the species of plants that needed to go in. But the guy that pulled it all together uh, was Dick Vendel. He was the construction manager. He was there. Um, as Nancy and I were talking earlier, if he could have his uh, hands and feet in the dirt, the deeper the dirt, the dirtier the dirt, the better overall. And he really helped uh, our crews shepherd this uh, rain garden uh, to help uh, act as a filtration uh, for everything that comes off this site. Uh, and it was really his project uh, and he took ownership uh, for it. And we wanted to make sure that uh, to recognize and honor such a special person uh, to uh, name this rain garden after him. And uh, when we had the opportunity to chat with Nancy, uh, Nancy uh, was uh, you know, very, uh, very happy for us uh, to do that. Uh, so at this time, um, I would like to say uh, thank you to everyone that participated. We have a number of our DPW folks that uh, were here when Dick was here and uh, had a chance to work uh, with Dick. And um, I know they appreciate all the work uh, that was done on this uh, as well. Um, I'd like to uh, recognize uh, Nancy and uh, brother Rick. Uh, I saw where Rick, uh, Rick was. And I just asked if uh, they'd uh, please come up uh, on behalf of uh, the family and uh, make, any, uh, make any comments. You do the talking. Yeah, on behalf of Nancy and the family here, we really want to thank everybody for coming out today. But we want to thank, you know, Tony, the town of Penfield, you know, Dick's love you know, everybody who knew him really knew that he really loved working here and like Tony said, getting in the dirt and the dirtier it was, the better it was. So he really, really, truly loved it. So this is really, really something to be dedicated to him. And I know on behalf of the family, they greatly appreciate it. And again, thanks everybody for coming out. This will be something that we can all come to and remember Dick for many, many years to come. And it's just a great thing and a great tribute to him and his life. So on behalf of everybody, thank you so much. Yep. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. 
Uh, just in closing, I think uh, one of the things that uh, we'll continue to do, and I'd be remiss if I didn't uh, recognize uh, Dick's brother, Bill, who uh, did uh, some uh, beautiful plantings here in the front uh, to really spruce up the front of this uh, you know, as a welcome as you come into this. And uh, one of the things that uh, we're looking to do is uh, to put a bench uh, right up at the top so that if anyone uh, would like to come, spend some time, kind of reflect, uh, remember uh, Dick and uh, some of those uh, special times that uh, you had with him, either as family, friends, uh, co-workers, uh, things like that. Uh, we want to do that uh, to, top, uh, to top this overall. Uh, but on behalf of the entire town board, I have Linda Cole here from the town board. On behalf of our entire uh, town board and the community of Penfield, uh, I want to say thank you to your, to your family. Thank you for sharing Dick uh, with us. Uh, thank you for everything that he did uh, for our uh, community. And uh, this is something uh, for generations uh, to come uh, that uh, we can remember him and uh, appreciate the fact that the weather held off. I heard somebody say when they first came in, it's a rain garden, shouldn't it be raining? Uh, it works well when it rains, uh, but uh, we thought uh, we'd take, do something different for a couple hours, maybe not have any rain, and uh, see if folks remember what the sunshine is and what the nice weather is. So thank you again for coming. Thank you for your time. And again, thank you to uh, the Vendel family for everything that uh, you have done for the town of Penfield. Appreciate it.